Hi there, today we're at the Artisans Co-op Gallery here in Bodega, California, and we're watching Christine Pascal do her hummingbird seed beating. It's, a, it's an amazing process. Now, can you tell us a little bit about how you start one of these? I mean, it seems like there's so many beads on here. Uh, the very beginning of beating the hummingbird is really four beads tied into a circle. And then I just keep working around that circle and go and forming the shape of the hummingbird as I go down. So now I really was excited to learn more about your sand dollars, Christine. Uh, they look like they're painted and there's embroidery on them. What, what am I looking at? Well, they're uh, painted with watercolors. So I'll um, find a picture or use a picture out of my head and um, paint onto the sand dollars with watercolor painting. And um, and I paint on both sides, two and one. So I'm seeing some beadwork there too, right yes. next to it. So what I do to make the sand dollar, because it's a smaller sand dollar, you can wear the art. And so I'll do the beadwork around where I'll pick up the different beads that match the color of this, the painting and um, bead it around. And then I'll work more beadwork around. And I'll show you on a different one, this one here. This one is just solid on the back. It doesn't have a sunset, but it's still very pretty in color. And then I do this beadwork after I do the around the edges. So it's like a netting. And then once that's done all the way around, then I slide the sand dollar into it and I can snug the thread up around it so that it is... Oh, instead of wire wrapping, it's bead wrapping. It's That's bead wonderful. Exactly. Now, you know, most people, if they find the sand dollars on the beach and they pick them up, the skeletons, they will crumble in their hands. Uh, how do you keep those from, you know, being uh, not crumbling? There's a product that I found that I put on the sand dollars and I do three coats on each side of the sand dollar and it has to cure really well in an oven in between each coat. So um, they're very durable to wear as jewelry. Beautiful.